Hey, my name is Kells, and this is my story about how I got caught stealing out of Walmart. Now, mind you, I was like 16 years old, didn't have money like that, and my mom was out of town. And I had like a little sneaky link, so I had to do what I had to do. Now, could you define sneaky link? I was about to have sex. <laughs> like, I don't know what else you want me to say. Okay. okay. But I was about to do what I had to do. Okay. So, anyways, like I said, uh, my mom was out of town or whatever, and I didn't have money at the time. Um, my brother was supposed to be watching me, but my brother didn't give a damn what I did. That's why I love my brother. So, he literally just got his car. Like, his car was brand spanking new. And my brother would do anything for me. So, I was like, Eddie... Can I hold your car really quick so I can go to Walmart and get some stuff? Yada, yada, yada. So he was like, yeah, sure, whatever. So he gave me his keys. Went to, I was on my way to Walmart. So this should have been a red flag for me. Um, so as I'm at like the light to turn from my street or whatever, I'm waiting at the light. And I had the right of way because it was green. And this other car was coming so so fast like he was about i guess he almost had the yellow light i don't know what it was he was trying to make it so i'm turning and he comes out and he hits this other car slams on the brakes and he had paint in the back of his truck or whatever so the paint like splattered all over oh, my brother's car yeah. so i'm like oh shit that's like some back to the future it was like literally like some back to the future shit so i'm like oh shit but I still need this sex. Like, <laughs> like I, I was screaming like crazy, but I was like, the sex is calling me. Like, I need it. Yeah, that brother's starving. Yes, sir, brother. So anyways, I was scared as hell or whatever. Like, it was no damage done to my brother's car, but he did have like paint all over his shit or whatever. So I tried to go to the gas station or whatever, and I tried to like wipe like the paint off of the uh, windows and all that shit. It was still there. So Eddie, this is why paint got on your car. I never told you. But anyways, if you see this. So anyways, <clears throat> I was like, fuck this. I'm still going to go like, because I was debating. I was like, Do, should I go or should I not go? And I was like, fuck it. I'm just going to go. So I get oh, so to walk. paint on your car. Man. Yeah, it's still paint on the car. And, and you just you I didn't give a going. damn. I kept going. He was trying to make it to that drywall. I was trying to <laughs> 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 Oh my I was literally trying to make it. I was like, look, I have to do this. This is the once in a lifetime opportunity. Mind you, it was somebody that I went to high school with, but I'm not going to say any names because this is somebody that is very popular and I wanted them for the longest, so I was getting it. So anyway, <laughs> I go to Walmart or whatever. So I'm in the parking lot and I'm just debating. Like, I'm like, okay, bitch, you ain't never do this before. Do you want to go through with this? You only got one shot. So I'm like, fuck it, I'm a G. I'm from Boynton, like, I ain't scared. Nothing else scared me. <laughs> so I get out of the car, I'm walking into Walmart. And then I turn back around and I went back to the car. What's all this stolen liquor, Danny Ocean? You hide up your butt? <laughs> Piss off! I was gonna do it, but there was a security breach. You never would have done it. I was like, no, 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 no. I can't do this. I can't do this. So, anyways, I just mustered up the courage. I was like, fuck it. We here now. Let's go. <laughs> so I go inside of Walmart. So I'm. You could tell I'm. I'm looking nervous as shit or whatever. But um. I went to um, the body wash section or whatever because I wanted to smell good. Like you can't go, you can't go to a sneaky link and be stank as hell. Like no, that's not how it's gonna work. So, anyways, I'm just like grabbing shit. So I grab body wash, I grab deodorant, and I had on a big ass jacket. <laughs> I looked so damn suspicious. Like niggas knew I was coming in there still. It's Florida. And it's, it's literally hot as hell. They're like, why in the hell is this nigga in this big ass jacket? So anyways, I'm in the section or whatever, so I'm grabbing a body wash. I'm thinking nobody ain't looking at me, so I'm grabbing it. Grab the body wash, grab deodorant, and um, I think I grabbed like toothpaste, toothbrush, and I was just like, just swiping that bitch. So I'm like, ooh, this is easy. Like, ain't nobody seeing me. So at the time, anybody that knows me knows that I'm a huge Brandy fan. Like, I love Brandy. So her new album came out, and like I said, my mom wasn't there. So I didn't have any money. So I was like, 
shit, if I can do this, I'm gonna get Brandy album. So I go to. Uh, this nigga got a mall in his jacket. I literally have a whole mall. Like, so I go to the electronics or whatever. So I'm like, okay. Here go Brandy CD. So I pick the CD up. So what I do is I go in the bathroom and I just like start taking the thing apart because back then with CDs, they had like the little buzzer on there and all that. So I was like, I'm going to take the booklet and I'm going to take the CD and then I'm just going to leave it. So I threw all that shit in the garbage. So I'm like, okay, I'm good to go. So I was like, you know what? Let me think smart. So I probably had like two or three dollars in my pocket. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to buy like a candy or like a soda or something to make it seem as if like... I ain't coming here to do nothing. <laughs> With your big ass jacket. With my big ass jacket. <laughs> I mean, you know what? It was it was literally a um Sean John big ass puffer jacket. <laughs> oh, it yeah. was it was green and it had a little fur coming out that bitch. Oh yeah. You so they knew thing, exactly. They knew what was going on. So anyways, um I get to the register. The lady y'all are friendly with me. Hi, oh, you found everything that you need. I'm like, yeah. I'm just like, yes, this is so smooth. She happy. I'm happy. I'm about to be out this bitch. So I think I, I got like candy and a soda or whatever. So went through with it. Um, paid as I'm almost to the exit. You know the song that go, doom, 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 doom. I'm thinking that in my head. I'm like, yes, bitch. I'm Free, bitch. Like, I felt like a slave that just got his papers, bitch. I was <laughs> out. So, as soon as I'm by the door, like, about to walk out, I hear two people. Hey, 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 hey. Ah, we seen what you did there. Why don't you come in the back with us? And I'm like, oh, fuck. Like, my whole mouth just dropped. I was so scared. I was like, what are you talking about? I didn't do anything. Oh, no, we saw how you swiped that deodorant. And you swiped um the body wash. Oh, and that brandy CD was really great. How you did that? So did they say that's sassy? Dude? They literally like. <laughs> let me tell. I'm telling you, they was. It was. A, it was a white dude. He he had to be gay, and it was um <laughs> he literally because he was so sassy, mm -hmm. uh, and then it was um a, a female. Um, so anyways, they took me to the back. They was like, and if you try to run, the police officer's out there. At the time, I'm a kid. I don't know what the fuck going on. So I'm thinking, oh shit, they might be right. The police officer's out there. If my mom find out, I'm finna get my ass beat. I'm just in trouble. So I go in the office. They interrogating me like, hell. Why did you do it? Why would you still body wash it? Da -da -da -da. And then, and then the dude was, listen, right. And then, and then the dude talking about, a brandy CD? Brandy out of all people? Is this who you decide to steal? I guess like, he didn't want to be down. <laughs> he ain't want to be down. <laughs> I don't want to be down. <laughs> I'm dying. So I'm like, I'm just like so nervous. Like, I don't know what the fuck is going on. I'm just in my mind. I'm just like, bitch, I'm finna go to jail. Like, all this for some dick. I could have stayed my ass home. So I'm just, I'm just panicking, I'm panicking, I'm panicking. And um, they, like I said, they were interrogating me, asking me questions. Why did I do it? Yada, yada, yada. And I was like, today is your lucky day. Um, <clears throat> you're lucky that you're a minor and we can't um, arrest you, but we're going to have to call somebody that is responsible for you. So I didn't get into my mom number, obviously, yeah. because like, why the fuck would I do that? So I gave him my brother number because I knew he wasn't going to answer. And um... They just let me go, but <laughs> I had to take a picture where it was like, <laughs> like a mug shot. Yes, when you get caught stealing, they place it on the wall, <laughs> and I was banned from the store for like five months, I think, or maybe yeah. it was longer. And mind you, this is my mom's favorite Walmart, so <laughs> so she would ask me to run errands or whatever to you know, like, go to Walmart or whatever and get some stuff for her. And I would be making excuses like, no, mom, I don't think we should go there. Let's just go to Target. Let's go somewhere else. I don't too much like this Walmart. Because lo and behold, my damn picture was going to be like this. <laughs> so I couldn't I couldn't do the shit. I had to fake the phone. But, um, yeah, that's basically it. Like, I got away. I didn't go to jail. But at the end of the day, I'm just going to say this. If you ain't got no money, stay your broke ass home <laughs> and stop trying to be grown up in these streets with your grown ass. And to the secret shoppers that caught me, bitch, if I see you in Boynton, I'm going to beat your ass. And that's on me.
Cause bitch, y'all could have ruined my life. But at the end of the day, I was protected and I was covered in the blood of Jesus. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. I'm Kels and I'm uh, out. So I question. I have um, one question. Yeah, I got one too. What's the question? So you said sex was calling you. It was. What number it called from? <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. <laughs> 69. Okay, that's good. That's solid. I was going to ask, was, mm-hmm. the, was the sex worth the anxiety that you experienced in Walmart? I didn't even have sex. I took my ass home. Yeah. Oh, that's I, that's I, I was, I I was afraid. I was like, yeah. hell no, I can't go down with this. Like, yeah. I just want to go home. I'm afraid. But I did miss out on a huge opportunity. I would. <laughs> A huge opportunity. Kels, this is by far the gayest story. Well, <laughs> <laughs> it's me! You're right, you're right. It's me! We love you. We love you, too. But. You said you went to high school? Yes, like we literally were like. Might have been smaller, too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. Right. No, he was like, really? I don't want to put too much. Well, fuck it. Can't beat my ass. He was really popular football player, and it was just like I had to get this opportunity because it was just like, damn, like you don't look up on stuff like this, and I wanted it so, and I didn't even end up getting it. Cause did he make it to the league? I don't know. I don't th- no. Actually, you know what? He did. He he probably a crackhead now. Oh, then, then you then you locked you out. Good. You good? Yeah, <laughs> he's he strong guy. Right. But what he missed with his the teeth. That's what I want to know. The car. I mean, <laughs> shit, he ain't got it no more. Like, we we older now. That shit was in the past. But, I mean, if he watched this, he going to know the truth because I definitely told a lie. It's out now. I definitely told a lie, but I'm grown as hell now. So. Please don't take nothing from my house. <laughs> no, I'm not going to lie. I was actually looking around to see what I could do. So. I appreciate it.